Hey, what's up guys? This is Maurice from Editors Depot. Thank you for watching this tutorial. Before I start, I just want to let you guys know there's a little announcement at the end of this video, so just watch all the way through. It's actually going to be somewhere between this video. So let's just go ahead and get started though. I don't want to bore you to death. All you're going to want to do is open up the Blender file. If I can open up. There we go. That was a little difficult. Oh, and by the way guys, step two is to like this video. So just go ahead and pause. I'll pause for you. Just like the video. Once you've liked the video, all you're going to want to do is simply hit the play button here. You pause in somewhere where you can clearly see the text and then you right click the text and hit the tab key. Oh, sorry, I'm messing up here. And you, once you do that, you're free to delete the text and write whatever you want. We're going to go ahead and write depot. A little difficult, wasn't it? So once you do that, all you're going to want to do is simply scroll down after you hit this F icon here while still selecting the text and you want to hit align center all the way in the bottom under paragraph. Now once you do that you simply offset the x-axis to make it fit once that looks perfect for us so we're gonna leave it. Now once you do that all you're gonna want to do is simply scroll down after you hit this this camera icon which is pretty much the render settings. You scroll down and you're gonna find this output and it's gonna say dream motion template 16. You want to select it, select where you want to save it and rename it. We're gonna name it that. After doing so, you scroll down again, and right below that, where you saved it, you're gonna select the render settings and put H.264. You could also go with QuickTime, but remember, if you go with QuickTime, you wanna change your video codec to H.264, so there's really no point, and AAC audio codec, and then bring your quality all the way up. It's just a little more work. There's no point for that. Go to H.264, and you're pretty much done, guys. All you gotta do is hit this render button here, and you're 100% done. Hope you appreciate this tutorial. My name is Maurice. This has been Editors Depot. And before you go, we're replying to every single comment on this video. That's right, every single one. Actually, we'll try to keep up with them because in a month from now, we might not be able to. But right now, if you're up, if I'm uploading this video and you're watching it live, or an hour late, or two hours late, or twelve hours late, just remember we're replying to your comments. So just go ahead and drop it in the, in the drop it below. So I hope you guys appreciate this video. My name is Maurice. This has been Editors Depot. Have a great day, guys.